My name is Hamish, but a lot of people sometimes they like to call me uh, Channel 5 Bacteria. A lot of call me Channel 5 Bacteria. Okay, so there's a lot of new ones here, okay? So if you're new, come right here, this subscription button, click the subscription button. You know what I'm saying? It's very, very important. Hit the like button and leave a comment, okay? I'll be very, very happy to when you leave a comment, you know, to respond to your comments, okay? Please, I welcome the comments. I'll be more than happy to respond to your comments. Let's go to the first question. They say half of radium. You know what I'm saying? Two to one is... So this is half-life question. They say half of radium, two to one in uh, radium, two to one in 30 seconds. Oh, in 30 seconds. Suppose you have a 320 gram sample. Oh, so we have a uh, 300 uh, uh, gram sample. You know what I'm saying? We have a gram sample. Now, let's go. This half-life, I think I'm gonna be sick. I was just trying to check here the question. This is half-life, half-life. So this must be half-life. Because I know for a fact this is a half-life question. So this is more of the half-life question now. So now, we have a formula for this, okay? So the formula say, excuse me, you say Q. So this is one solution. So the formula say Q, X, means it's a quantity final, equal to sample initial, or you can say Q naught, you can write Q. However, some people, they can say Q final, after a certain time, T, equal to Q initial, and they say E power KT. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Just algebraic uh, writing, you know? So you can use this, you can use this. Okay, now let's use, stick for the first one, either one. But uh, this is gonna be initial sample, initial quantity, and this is final quantity after, let's say, how long, okay? So for now, let's just use like the first one. It doesn't matter whichever one you use, as long as, you know, you explain your work. Okay, so for this case, this is gonna be initial sample, and then we're gonna have an E, K, T, this T determines seconds, like how we see, and this initial sample, this is final sample. Let's go. You know what I'm saying? So now let's go. So, uh, you can write like that if you want, or if you don't. Me, I prefer personal write like this. Q of a certain time, T equal to Q, initial, you know what I'm saying? And then I'm going to say E times KT. This is my always going for, you know, but some other books that write like that. Well. So now let's go. The important thing information now. So they say time in 30 seconds, so we know time here in 30 seconds. Now, they say suppose you have 320, meaning initial is 320. So my initial 320. But since they say half-life means if this is 320 initial, the half of it is going to be 160 because look, 320 if you half is going to be what's going to be? 160. Why do we have? Because half-life means if I have a 320, for now, so this initial 320, according to how they gave us, okay, but equal, finally, because it's half life, is going to be 160. 320 by 2 equal to oh, 160, and then we can say E, K, but what is time? Time equal to 30 seconds. So here we're going to say what? 30. You know what I'm saying? Cool, now we go. So now we're going to make K the subjects, that's the phase process. So what we're going to do, divide by 360 throughout, divide by 360, divide by 3, uh, 320, 320, this and this is going to cancel, 0, 0 cancel, uh, this is going to be half, by 16, 1, how many 16, 32, there are 2, equal to E, 30K, or you can say 30K, or K30, same thing, you know what I'm saying, so we have to make K the subjects, how are we going to make K the subjects, whenever you have an E, and then you want to get the unknown, the only easy way to get this, if you have an E, the only way you can get this value here, apply loan throughout. Loan or lean, some people call lean, some people call loan, whatever. So loan on the left, which is one over two. And this is going to be loan of E 3K. So we know loan, it works like a logarithm. So all this half is going to go behind here. Behind, so it's going to be loan of a half. But loan of a half is like a loan of one from loan rule. If I have a loan of A over B, this is loan of A minus loan of B, means you take the top one minus, this is not the same as loan of A over loan of B, no, different thing, don't say this is equal to loan of A minus loan of B, no, it's not equal, you know what I'm saying, but this yes, means it must be in one thing, these two different things, okay, so this is not equal to this, okay, this is equal to that, so for that case, this one, yes, you can say minus go, so it's going to be loan of the top, minus none of the second equal to this 3k is going to go behind 3k and then here we're going to be left with none of e but a mathematical none of e equal to one none of e equal to one okay cool so none of e equal to one so it's going to be 30k times one equal to 30k 
and this will be ln of 1 equal to 0. ln of 1 equal to 0. So I'll let me write here. ln of e equal to 1 and ln of 1 equal to 0. So this will be 0. 0 minus ln of is going to be minus ln of 2 only because it's going to be 0 minus. 0 minus anything is just whatever you have. Like 0 minus 1 equal to minus 1. So this will be only because this is 0 minus the 30 k. So divide by 30 and yeah, divide by 30. This and this cancel. So our k equal to negative ln of 2 over 30. So this is our k. Okay? So now we got our k. You know what I'm saying? We got our k. So that's why they ask, find the formula for the mass of the mining. Find the formula. So this is a formula. Okay. So me. No, this is not formula yet. So let's say find the formula of the mass of the mining after t second. So this was for the 30 second. So the formula we know, we're going to have to use the same formula. T we don't know. K now we know. So the first rule, like whatever they give this half life, find K. Find K, okay? Find K, right? So we did get K. So now they want us to use the same formula, but I will know not T. Oh, come on, man. That's easy. So I'm going to say my formula right now is going to become Q. So T we don't know. That's why I, I prefer to say this is uh, Q, T. It's not X. You know what I'm saying? Me, I'll say this is T, and this I'll say is Q at T. Whatever you prefer. Q at initial means when we start. You know what I'm saying? But you can put however you prefer. Q at initial. So I'm going to say QT equal. Do we have a sample initial? Oh, yes, we do have a sample. How we started, which is 320. So our sample initial, because we're going to use this formula now. A sample initial equal to 120, 320 times E times E. So K now we have. What is a K? K is this. You know what I'm saying? And then we times by T. T we don't know. So we're going to say, oh, so it's going to be K because this K which equal to, uh, okay. Let's do this K. What is a K? Negative ln of 2 over 30. And the times our T, just write T like this. You know what I'm saying? So this is what we need here. Oh my god, I write like like a box or something. It's supposed to be like this. You know what I'm saying? Or oh, I can write, uh, let me write here. So it can look neat and clean. So fresh is so cream cream. So fresh is the cream cream. Let's go. Okay. So QT. After certain time, t after t second equal to 320. Let me write again. 320 e e k, but our, our k we know negative ln of 2 over 30 times t. Okay, so this is the first one. So for the second one, so use the formula to determine how much sample remain after 200, how much sample is going to remain. So if I start with 320, how is it going to remain? If I'm going to put my t to 20, let me see, I'm going to put 20 to 20, and then I'll have to find the qt. qt like for that time, finally. Okay? This is like initial, and this final. So you're going to say q, but what is your t for this case? 220, 210, 210, 210. Oh, yeah. So 320, okay. e, negative ln of 2 over 30. All this stuff multiplied by 2. 10. You know what I'm saying? So make sure you plug in the calculator. You put in bracket, calculator. Where's my calculator? Okay, so plug in the calculator. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So now when you plug in the calculator, 2.5 0.503. Okay, so you put in the calculator, this is going to give you a 2.5, Okay, so I give us 2.503, but a gram means if I'm going to start, so this is quantity of 210 times. When we take three, 210 seconds, we're going to be left with this. If I start with 320, I start with 320, and if I take 210 seconds, I'll be left with this. You know what I'm saying? Oof. It's almost finished. You start 320 left with this. Means if I take more time, nothing will be left with it. Okay? Let's say somebody take, a, a, let's say, twice of the time. Let's say 420. We know we're not going to left with anything. Just using common sense. Okay? Now, let's go. 
For the third one, they say how after how many minutes? After how many minutes? Okay, after how many minutes? Okay, for the third one now. After how many minutes will only 10 gram remain? Oh, so now finally it's gonna be 10 gram. Let's say this finally, this is a formula, right? Finally is 10 gram remain. But we know initial is 320 gram. I don't have to say gram for now, I can just ignore this one. Initial is 320 gram, which is initial E is E. They say after how many minutes? Okay? So K, I know my K. What is my K? This is my K here. That's my K. So I'm gonna say negative log of two over 30. We wanna find what our time. You know what I'm saying? So let's get a time. So our time, remember, is gonna be second. And then after we get second, we're gonna change it to minutes. Okay, now let's grind now. So how I'm gonna get T first of all divided by 320? Divided by 320. You know what I'm saying? This and this go. So this and this can. So it's gonna be one over 32 equal to this and this one. It's like E. And here's gonna be uh okay, negative long. Okay, plug in calculator, negative, uh lean of two. And then over 30. Okay, we get negative zero, negative zero point zero two three one. Okay, excuse me. So this is gonna be uh, a negative zero, comma zero, two three one, two three one times t. If I wanna get t, how I wanna get t? I must apply long throughout. Like I say, if you have whatever you have, and then power. If you have e power whatever, if you wanna get this stuff, which if it's a non, you have to apply long throughout. So long of one, but over thirty two. What happens? Say long of one minus long of thirty. No, let's apply step by step, step by step. It's okay what I'm doing, but uh, it's not gonna skip the step. So this is going to be ln of 1 over 32 equal to ln of e power, power negative 0, 0, 2, 3, 1, t. So what I'm going to do now, remember this is going to go to the back of ln, except up. So it's going to come here behind. Okay, this is going to give us ln of 1 minus ln of 32 from the ln rule. Okay, so let me raise here because I need a space, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to go under, let's just raise this stuff here. So now let's go. So this gonna be ln of one, which is zero because ln of one minus ln of thirty-two. So you say ln of one minus ln of thirty-two, but I want ln of one equal to zero. Equal to this half is gonna come behind. So negative zero comma zero two three one zero two three one t, and they have a ln of e. But we know ln of e equal to one. We know ln of e equal to one. So this half here equal to one. So anything times one is that something. If we say seven times one equal to seven. K times 1 equal to K. So that means this is going to be, so we're going to be left with negative 0, 0, 0,0231T because you take that one multiply by 1. You, might, you should say here an example, but ln of E equal to 1 is very, very important, right? It has a max also. So ln of 1 equal to 0, you can say also ln of 1 equal to 0. Also ln of 1 equal to 0. So this is going to be 0 minus that. So it's going to give us minus ln of 30. 2 equal to this. Okay, so how are we going to get t? Divide by this, divide by this. You know, so divide. Divide by what? By? By? By what? By? Negative 0, 0, 0,0231. 0, divide by negative 0, 0,0231. 0, this in this cancel. So our time equal to negative 32 over negative 0, 0,0231. 0, you know what I'm saying? And this is like this. This is this, which gives us this. So if I don't want it, they say, leave your answer alone. For example, sometimes they may say, leave your answer alone. Means I can just take that and write it back because I got this answer here by simplifying this. Let's say, leave your answer alone. So say, okay, ln of 32 over negative bracket. Let's say, ln of 2 over 30. And then this equal to t. No, write your answer is no more second. Okay, so for that case now, I can do that. So I'm gonna take negative ln of 32, negative uh, ln of, 
Look how say negative one of 32, negative lean or long, whatever you call it. 32, right? Uh, 32, yes, 32. Okay, and then divided by our answer, we get 150. So our time equal to 150. You know what I'm saying? Our T equal to 150. So our time taken, our time taken equal to 150 second. You know what I'm saying? But how do they say? They say it must be in minutes. How many minutes? So 150, how are you going to change to minutes? No, you should do this, man. How many minutes in here? Oh, I think it's two minutes and a half. Because look, we know in uh, we have to divide by six. Because look, from 150, they say 60 seconds. There's uh, the 60 seconds, one minute, another six seconds, two minutes. So we're going to have a two minutes and a half. Because one minute to one minute, we're going to be left with 30 seconds. So 30 seconds means a half minute. So it's going to be two minutes and a half, so like 2.5 minutes. So this equal to 2.5 or 2.5 minutes. Because they say, how many? Easy, man. Listen, you first time here, please leave a comment here, right? I'll be very, very happy to respond to your comments. And this is how we do these half-life things, man. I'm out here. Hey, hey. We are, are, are. We are, are, are. We gone, gone, gone. I'm out. Easy.